Okay, good morning. So today we're going to be talking about how to create, upload, and then share your video links for your personal uh, peak performance presentations using the private setting on YouTube. Now, some of you have uh, asked me to show you how to do this so that you can just send the video to me and I totally get that. You don't want to put your videos out there for the whole world to see. That's totally reasonable. So we're going to take a look at how to do this today. So it's four simple steps. So number one, you have to first film your video, whether you do that on your phone or on your laptop. I'm doing mine on my laptop. Um, then you're going to go ahead and upload that video to YouTube. So you can see that when you're in your YouTube account, there's this little button here called create. And when you click on it, it allows you to upload a video. This is where I add all of my support videos that I use for supporting my students both in my foundations classes and my English classes. So once you've finished your video, now I'm, here's an important point to note, your video should not be longer than about 14 minutes. That seems to be the maximum length that YouTube will sustain, which is perfect because that fits within our timing window for these personal presentations anyways. So then you would click here and then you go ahead and find your video wherever it may be stored and you'll upload it. So I, I uh, don't have a video ready because I'm actually creating this video to, to show that. So um, let's just go here. We'll see if we can find an old video from one of my other classes that I would upload. So take one from the English class that I've been teaching here. So yeah, we've got all kinds of different videos here. This one's on uh, how to write a conclusion paragraph down here. So if this was the video I wanted to share with a private setting, I would click on that and then it goes ahead and it uploads it here into um, the YouTube portal. And you can see that it's going to give us an ability to put in some details here. This video is a demo on writing conclusions. So then you put you could put this this video as my personal peak performance presentation and you can see down here that it's quickly uploading the video content into your YouTube account. So you can see that here is all been saved at private. Now we go to the next screen and it's going to say, you know, who is this who is this intended for? I always say that it's not intended for kids because the content is, you know, for students in university. And then it's just asking you do you want to add like a an image that'll go with your video. I just go with the standard stock settings here. And it's just checking, it'll check for copyright infringement. So obviously you don't want to use any songs or clips from other videos that are other people's intellectual property within your own presentation um, because that might cause a copyright claim against you. So you can see now first it does the initial um, upload. Now it's doing the processing which is part of the it's, it's um, checking the quality and also checking for uh, any type of copyright infringements. So next we go to next and then you can see here is where you get to choose what type of a video it is. So you have three choices. So we're going to click private today and then you're going to share, click share privately. And then in this box, you'll actually write down my email account. So Matthew Finlayson at viu.ca and then you're going to click done. So you can see that the video will be privately shared with me um, and so then I will I will basically erase the video once I'm done with it so you don't have to worry about that and then eventually once you're done you're going to copy this link as well for your own um, records. I should get the link but you can also email me a copy of this link just to be doubly sure. So then you go ahead and save those settings. Now it's going to take a few minutes here to complete the processing uh, of the video. So um, we'll just take a minute and hopefully it'll, it'll kind of happen nice and quickly. We can see that additionally it's going to be sitting here in your account. So one of the nice things about uh, YouTube as a resource is that you're able to use it to put up any videos at all. Um, and you can see that for me personally as a teacher, I've got literally hundreds of different videos. So if you're ever interested in getting support for writing, essay writing and things like that, most of my support videos are about how to write essays. Some of them go over um, different aspects of writing processes. Um, there's even some talk, some discussion about how to 
analyze different types of writing if you're taking any English classes in your university career. So that can also perhaps be uh, helpful for you. So basically, I'm just kind of burning time right now because what I want to see is that once we've actually gone ahead and finished and completed, that the link actually does um, show up in, in my account at VIU. So we'll go ahead and actually check that out here. I'll just go ahead and log in to my VIU account. I've been told that when I type, it's quite loud in my video, so I'm trying to keep it down here. Oh, that's that's VIU learns, which is perfect. And then we'll go here. I'll need that in a second anyways, because I'm gonna upload this, this video once it's done to our page so that anybody in our class can access it. There's a few students who are doing their videos and sending them in this week. I haven't started marking the finals yet, but most of the presentations have been done. We had a round of them yesterday. Okay, so yes, as we can see, we're just waiting for this to be finished here. Okay, 92%, so we're almost there now. Okay, so that is all done. It is set as private. Only the people you choose can see this video. This video won't appear on your channel or search results. So in theory, if we go back and renew, 